The two-year silence of the Calypso Tents will be broken on Saturday the 28th of May. Among those on the lineup is newly established Kaiso Pro's tent, KPT, led by former Calypso monarch T.C. Brown. A Kaiso on the water, also known as Fire One Calypso Tent, is also on the schedule. We have the guys from the south. Tony Wilkinson and his group will be at the National Cultural Center for the first showing. Then we move to a new tent, the Kaiso Pro's tent, under the leadership of T.C. Brown, will be on Tuesday. Um, the 31st of May in their first outing and then we move um, also um, and then as we go along we have the Soka Ultimate again on the 3rd of June at a venue to be determined we, we still haven't had that sorted out as yet um, and then Soka Village TOT collaboration starts on June, June 4th at the National Cultural Center, followed by Fire One on the 5th. No, sorry, Fire One is on the, on the 11th, 11th June at the National Cultural Center. For patrons hoping to enjoy what's on offer at the tents, the final Calypso show is slated for June 9th, 2022. Quarterfinals begin June 17th, in the week of June 17th. Um, Friday, Saturday, and, and Sunday, Sunday which is Father's Day, so these are the three. The big semi-finals on Sunday, June 26th, and Saturday, June 9th, is the date chosen for the Calypso Finals. The Carnival Music Management Committee will seek guidance from the Health Ministry as to the protocols for the events. We have written to the CMO asking for the um, specific protocols for Calypso and for all our shows, and um, we are awaiting um, response. In the meantime, the tent leaders are pursuing the usual mass crowd um, requirements, which includes getting um, a letter from the CMO. Additionally, the Carnival Music Management Committee recently introduced an elimination stage to the Groovy and the Power Soaker competition. The intention is to reinvigorate the judging process and improve performances at the Soka Semis and the Soka Monarch Finals. Joachim Duplessis, HTS News Force.